It's very important uh, to say that after the Human Rights Council resolution, the Office of the High Commissioner uh, wrote a, a, a very important report uh, uh, checking about violence and discrimination against uh, in terms of sexual diversity. And one of the numbers, one of the most difficult numbers is today you can find around 75 countries around the world uh, where the homosexuality is a crime. And it's a private matter uh, between other people. However, it's a crime in some cases with uh, very harsh penalties uh, for, for, the per for, for, for the human being, for the perpetrators, for the, for the people. Bueno, you have different front lines. One of them is obviously government. You have to raise awareness of parliamentarians, judiciary, executive branches. You have to change policies. You have to change legislations. But at the same time, it's very necessary to change the heart and the minds of human beings. And it requires a, a, public, a wide public education uh, a, explaining that there is not a space for discrimination in this world. The campaign was launched globally uh, last July 2013 in South Africa by the High Commissioner for Human Rights, Ms. Navi Pillay, and the Emerit Archbishop Desmond Tutu, uh, among other big important figures, uh, with the aim to raise awareness globally about the rights and the fundamental uh, rights and freedoms for of uh, all the LGBT community people, uh, uh, the same like the rest of human beings. It's uh, quite relevant. Is we are launching here in Sao Paulo today this campaign in Brazil, and in, it, I think it's the first one in Latin America, and it's, that is a good signal. Um, and it's very relevant too to have that uh, launching in a, uh, in, in a local government, in a, in a local space, uh, when you will find many authorities and civil society organizations and many people around. Um, but it's very necessary to replicate publicly the message. The message, the message. Free and equal is the main concept of our campaign. The UN expectations are, number one, to raise awareness globally, worldwide, if it's possible, but it's, it's very important to be focused on, on the government authorities, especially, and, and also to try to include some changes in terms of uh, public information, in terms of responsibilities, in terms of education, uh, uh, with the main concept is the Article 1 of the Universal Human Rights Declaration about no discrimination and we are equal, free and equal, all human beings. It's very important to be treated like human beings. We are all different. That is fantastic for humankind. It's fantastic for the life. And obviously the most difficult is to change the consciousness of people, but it will come. We have to continue and continue, but it will come. There will come a day where everybody will be equal and free.